All right, across the area, we are looking very nice with mainly sunny to partly cloudy skies. Back to the west, we are watching a very powerful storm system. See lots of yellow boxes. Those are tornado watches. Looks like even a tornado warning just outside of Knoxville, Tennessee. We will continue to monitor this frontal system because it will bring us showers and thunderstorms very early on your Wednesday morning while you're sleeping. So let's go ahead and jump ahead into very early Wednesday morning around 2 o'clock in the morning. Heavier showers and thunderstorms will begin to push into the mountains and foothills and a few of those thunderstorms could be strong to severe around 5 o'clock. Right here in the middle, right here coming through the triad, we're talking about some very heavy rain, strong winds, maybe some hail. Cannot rule out maybe an isolated tornado coming in with this line roughly around 4 or 5 o'clock in the morning. By 8 o'clock in the morning, things will begin to wind down just a little bit. So if you have to get up early, maybe just delay your travel a little bit. I think after 8 o'clock on your Wednesday morning, things will begin to settle down. But we're not quite done. Everything will break out ahead of our main frontal system. So roughly around lunchtime when the actual cold front shows up, you see another line of showers and thunderstorms getting going and pushing eastbound. It looks like the second line, if it forms, should be a little bit weaker than the first line we see first thing on our Wednesday morning. So hopefully that will pan out. So here we are around 5 o'clock on your Wednesday evening. Things will begin to settle down. We're looking for the skies to clear out. Still very breezy, but that wind for our Wednesday, especially during the afternoon and evening time period, we're dragging some colder air. How, how much colder could it be? Well, we might even see some snow showers breaking out along the border of North Carolina and Tennessee along the high elevations first thing on Thursday morning. So with the severe weather threat coming in mainly between 2 o'clock and 8 o'clock in the morning, there is that low tornado threat. Looks like the hail and wind threat will be a tad bit higher. So just keep that in mind. Have a way to get warnings while you're sleeping. Some warnings could be issued very early on your Wednesday morning. Right now, partly cloudy skies in 82. We topped out at 83 warm degrees with a strong south to southwest wind at 18 miles per hour blowing in lots of hot air. You see everyone still sitting in the 80s with 84 over there in Lexington, putting everything all together. There's the frontal system that will be responsible for perhaps the severe weather we see first thing on your Wednesday morning. By our Thursday morning, the front will be well off the coast. The cooler air will take over. We're talking about high temperatures only in the 50s for your Thursday afternoon. So here's your forecast for tonight. Showers and thunderstorms moving in, looking for a low of 63. Scattered showers and thunderstorms in the morning that could refire roughly around lunchtime, looking for a high of 72 degrees. Then after that, get ready for a big cool down. Highs only in the 50s, morning lows falling into the middle 30s, maybe even some lower 30s will be possible. So we're talking about frost and freeze conditions could be possible later on this week. Then our numbers will begin to warm up by your Tuesday, climbing up to around 74.